Hello, my name is Igor Postovets from GDIO and I will guide you today through the tutorial of how to create the optimal UV maps and textures for 3D characters using the automatic and optimal unwrapping tool Anvela version 2. Anvela 2 is a new version of our software developed for automatic unfolding of 3D geometries with exact pixel to model surface aspect ratio designed to speed up significantly UV map baking and creating minimized surface stretchings. In this tutorial we will use the low poly NAAT creature model done for a period and real time game unfold it optimally with a minimal effort and bake on it the normal map from the half million faces model in just 5 minutes. This presentation will also illustrate you the clear advantages of using this unique tool and techniques over the classical manual work that takes 10 times longer and yet produces less exact results. As first we will load the 3D model. It is a 4500 faces armored monster with mixed topology of round and edgy surfaces. It consists at the moment of the body, the hands and the head. We start first with the body. Add UWV unwrap modifier on the model and start drawing the marker edges. The first thing to do now is to separate the arms from the rest of the body. Draw the seams around the shoulders and one seam along the bottom side of the arm. Repeat this action also on the opposite side. Now do it also for the legs. Part the legs from the body and try to follow the given line flow. Repeat this action now also on the opposite leg. Since we create a model for a third person game, we will try to create a splitting scene on the side of the body, since we will see our actor mostly from the front or from the back side. Draw the seams around the pelvis, along the legs and on the feet. Follow the line flow of the polygon edges and try always to surround with your seams the areas that can produce later cylindrical, hemispherical or plane shapes. After you have finished with the seams placement, the model parts will be marked with the blue lines. These blue lines are not the UV seams. They are just representing your surface parts and we need now to convert them to the real UV seams. For this purpose we have created a small helper tool called Umbrella Seam Creator and you can download it free from www.3d-plugin.com slash maxscripts. Open this tool and press the button Use Part Seams. In a second all your blue markers get turned into the full UV seams. You can always recognize the UV seams by the green color. This small tool also automatically applies Umbrella modifier to your model. Our model has now proper UV parts without UV coordinates and all you have to do now is to press apply button in the Umbrella modifier. As you can see the model is now fully unwrapped and the UV chunks are optimally packed and we have done it just in few seconds. Let us now take a closer look at the final result. Umbrella unwrapped the model using our seams on almost all parts of the model. Yet we can still see blue lines on the back side of the legs. This indicates that it was impossible for Umbrella to create a uniform surface with a minimal pixel stretching. The main reason is the extreme polygon crunching and bending that will later cause inevitable texture stretching. At this point we can leave the Umbrella to decide whether to break the form in order to keep the minimal stretching or to help it with our own hand placed seams. For the sake of the presentation I will now define one more seam on the leg to get the UV parts just as I want them to be. Press again the umbrella seam tool and the new blue seams are instantly converted into the green edges. Click now on apply in the umbrella modifier and you will get the perfect result. Unwrapping these parts by hand, pelting and relaxing them, rotating and moving them around would have been much 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 more work. One thing you would hardly get by doing this work manually is the almost perfect pixel distribution over the surface. All pixels have the same size and it is likely your normal map later won't have visible seams. 
visible seams in the normal maps appears always on the address where two UV chunks have different pixel sizes and proportions. Beside the automatic unwrapping with optimal pixel proportions, Umbrella 2 also has now two different calculation modes. It can work on triangle and quad polygon level. You don't need to export your model from Max to some other 3D party unwrapping tools, causing time wasting, losing pivot point positions or morph targets. Umbrella 2 is a native 3D modifier compatible with your modifier stack. Let us finish the rest of the body. Select the remaining head and add Umbrella 2 modifier to it. Heads are very difficult to unwrap since they are spherical and they have holes on them. To fix it we will put first the cap holes modifier on the head and close for this moment the eyes. This will help Umbrella to unfold the model without considering the eyes as a green edges that needs to be connected. Press apply and you will get in a second the unfolded 3D hand. The hands are now very easy. Just draw the blue seams along the sides, convert them to the edge and press apply in the umbrella modifier. This way you have got optimally unwrapped hands in less than a minute. We will now attach all body parts to one model, unfold and pack them with umbrella. The size of chunks is maximized as much as possible and they are arranged to utilize maximal space on the available UV map. This optimal distribution prevents a significant part of texture memory from being wasted due to the padding between chunks. Additionally, this feature makes texture seams invisible even under careful inspection. Texture stretching and scaling on the surface is removed almost completely. Every pixel translates to the same size and aspect ratio on the model surface and creates uniform visual appearance without reduction in the texture sharpness on some areas. So far we are done. The rest is the standard max render to texture work. We load the high poly model, cover it with the low poly model we have unfold with umbrella and let 3D max render the normal map. At the end I would like to resume what we have done in the last few minutes. We have loaded a complicated 3D model and we have drawn our own seams on it. We have converted the seams into UV parts and let Umbrella unfold the model. Since Umbrella 2 has a new feature to preserve the seams, the model was unfolded just as we have predefined it. It saved us hours of work, it has created uniform visual appearance of the map, saved UV space and raised the overall quality of the texture.
I would like to thank you for your time and attention and to invite you to download the trial version of this unique mapping software from www.umbrella.com. If you have any questions or need information about our products, please feel free to contact us via www.3d-plugin.com.